An attorney representing people who've been sending out those KKK flyers is telling Virginia police departments to back off. Peggy Fox has more from Leesburg. The KKK flyers first started showing up in this Leesburg neighborhood in October. Then more came in other neighborhoods in January. Now, two weeks ago, Lovettsville. It's very disturbing. Pastor Michelle C. Thomas kept one of those baggies filled um, with the papers. Yeah. Right. So the first one, white brothers and sisters, there's nothing hateful and showing pride for your race. They've ramped up their efforts. So cute, cool kids club, white pride, white power, and that equates to the cool kids club. Can you believe that? Both the Leesburg Police Department and Loudoun County Sheriff's Department have been investigating these KKK flyers, gathering information. Now, we have a letter from an attorney in Arkansas whose name is Jason Robb. He says he represents the people who've been distributing this literature. He writes that the investigation is disturbing to him because his clients, he says, are exercising their freedom of speech. If, it's not like, you know, somebody shot her. I mean, they ran one a guy guy from Manti I think they have a right to put out flyers. I think, you, you know, you have to look at not the, the speech, but at who's making the speech and what's their history and what's their intent. And I think that at that point, when you start analyzing that direction, it causes, it causes more concern. So it's not the same as the NAACP putting out flyers? The NAACP has not to have a history of putting people on trees. Uh, we don't have a history of, of running cars into people. Uh, we don't have a history of, of, of threatening to kill and actually doing that intimidation. We don't tell our members to go into churches and shoot up people. If we don't stop it, if we don't stand up collectively as a group of um, citizens to say we are every color, nation and creed, we stand against hate, unless we do that, they'll continue to think that they have a home here. An organization called Hate Not Hope has sprung up. They've got orange ribbons and are hosting events. One is coming up on March 5th and it is featuring reformed KKK members. In Leesburg, Peggy Fox, WUSA 9. The Loudoun County Sheriff's Department says it is investigating those KKK flyers to see if any crime has been committed.